Welcome back. My name is Sharfay Yunus and in this video we will learn how we can provide different values for the same type of object with health. In the previous example we talked about alert system. So basically we have a module called alert system module. We have an abstract interface class called alert system and we have a house that needs an alert system in order to alert. All right? So to provide this alert system, since it is an, an interface, we need to create a module. And inside this module, we have to specify the lifecycle of its object and how we can create it. Now, let's say we have another example of alert system. Let's say, for example, we have lock alert system, lock alert system, like that, that implement the alert system. Like that and in its method all right so basically this alert system will lock everything inside this house now how this house object will pick one of these two now in this module we will have to provide also the noise alert system or the lock alert system we have to type also provides fun provide lock alert system okay we run it like that we need also to provide the type alert system okay just return the lock alert system like that and we don't need context here so we can delete it like that and go back to the alert system and also delete it from here okay we delete everything here just copy that so we can show it all right now how this alert system module will provide one of these the house need a, an alert system how we can specify which alert system we want basically there are two methods there are named annotation you have to provide an annotation called named it is from java inject and here you will have to type something manually string manually let's call it noise alert like that and here also you have to type named and let's call it log alert okay now inside your house in order to get one of this basically you will have to also use the name like that and here type the log alert okay now as you can see if you delete t it won't work because it will scan all the string and see if you type on this sign here it will get you the alert if you use the noise alert on place of it let's go back here and click on this it will go to the noise alert this is one way you can use a named annotation in order to provide a custom implementation for the same type if you run it now we are providing the noise alert so we will see noise 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 if we provide the lock alert and run it again we will see something else here we will see i am locking all the windows if you provide if we make an error here and run it basically you will have a compilation error okay because it doesn't know it cannot be provided so this is one way somehow it is safe because the health will scan all the string but since it is static language, you can, we can make errors here. Okay, so in order to prevent these errors also, there is another method called qualifiers. Okay, you will have to build your custom qualifiers. Okay, so in order to do that, we will have to see another example. Let's see the known example application qualifier. Let's delete that go to application context this is an example of qualifiers because as you know there is multiple instances of context there is application context and there is activity context all right so how health knows which context to provide using this annotation basically click on it as you can see this is qualifier qualifier is coming from the inject basically you can do the following you can copy that all that and paste it somewhere here qualifiers yes 
convert it to Kotlin. All right. And I won't use application context. Let's delete that and let's call it the lock like that. Now, basically, you will have to type here at lock. Okay. And if you want another one, you can delete that and use noise. And basically, you would go here and type noise. Okay. Now, in the house, you will have to specify with what annotation you want your system. Okay. So, to do that, let's just call it lock. This time, it will provide you with the lock. If you run the application now, it will provide you with the lock. Here is the lock working. If you rename it to noise and run it, it will provide the noise implementation. So as you can see, there are basically two methods in order to provide the same, the same type of thing with different values using qualifiers with special notations, or you can use the named annotation. With named, you have to type with named you have to type a special string and a unique string for each provide. Okay, in the next couple of videos, we'll talk about health for testing and we will see a real example using health in a real system. Okay, thank you very much for watching this video and see you in the next videos.